Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So last week I posted that the Microsoft PC Manager app could become a default app on Windows 11 because in an up-and-coming update uh, for the OS, Microsoft is going to add uh, the PC Manager app to devices by default in China. Now that video will be in the end screen if you want more info. But my reason for mentioning the PC Manager becoming available to devices in China is because another Microsoft product now is only becoming available uh, to the uh, Chinese region. And this time it's WSA, which is Windows Subsystem for Android, where uh, Microsoft and Tencent have announced a partnership, which basically will let customers in China run Android apps from the Microsoft Store on Windows 11. Now this is after, as I mentioned back in March of this year, that Microsoft... Um, is deprecating Windows Subsystem for Android in 2025. And as of the 6th of March this year, um, the Amazon App Store no longer was available for download from the Microsoft Store on Windows 11 devices. And as I mentioned in that video, which will also be in the end screen if you'd like some more info, is because um, this was due to, and it was suggested due to the lack of Google support, obviously, with this whole um, process. Now, if you're asking why is Microsoft um, only rolling out WSA in China, according to Tencent, and by the way, this is the report, which is in Ch uh, Chinese, so you just have to translate it uh, into English in your browser, and I'll leave this down below if you would be interested. According to this report, um, Tencent has said uh, the PC side has a huge user base, and we hope to work with Microsoft Store and Intel through the PC version of and I don't know how to pronounce this name, so there you go, to provide technology, traffic, and commercialization support for mobile developers on cross-terminal integration and jointly promote the PC application ecosystem, um, prosperous development, and provide users with a better cross-terminal experience. So that's according to uh, the vice president of Tencent in this report. And basically, in a nutshell, what this means, um, as you may well know, that China um, is a large market and Tencent has a large user base and obviously a lot of apps uh, to basically justify Microsoft now allowing WSA in China. And according to Microsoft, um, a, a report from Microsoft, um, the scale of new additions to some games currently on the PC version of this name again, and I can't pronounce that, has increased by 100% compared with the single mobile version. So the PC scenario payment of some games accounts for more than 40% of the market turnover. And the next day retention, they say, of new games is 1.9 times that of the market. So that's basically why Microsoft is pushing WSA into China and deprecated in other regions. And that's according to the report, the exception while this is all taking place. And um, Tencent also plans to bring over 1,500 mobile apps and games to the Microsoft Store. So obviously they have a huge app base uh, in China. And if you are thinking of a comeback um, of WSA in other parts of the world, um, I personally don't think it's going to happen because obviously without the Google support, and the input from a large Android app base, such as Google Play, um, due to that lack of support by Google, I don't think this is something we will see come back um, in other regions globally. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.